Hi guys, welcome to the first video of Ascalonian Dungeon featuring Exploding Mode. This video is about the first method, Hojins. Let me pause the video for a set and show you the plan because this will give you an idea of how we are going to do this. Hi guys, this is the map and as you can see there are six burrows. First, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth and the third one will be in the left corner of the map so just be aware of that now as for the mobs we have three types that i consider to be annoying to deal with the first one is the breeder and they're gonna spawn the hatchlings and those little guys will come af after you at the same time and the second one is the scarf they will attack you and they will sometimes do a special leaf which will two hits kill you you just be aware of that and the third one is the howler what they're gonna do is they're gonna buff the, the allies with these two right here now as for the group we have five of us and we're gonna divide by two in the first group dps the second one only one guy in here and the third guy will be the attackers two of them now this is how we run it the DPS will be standing on top of the table and the kiter will be standing next to Hojins and the third guy, two of them, will be standing on the uh, next to the uh, second burrow. Now, the job of the DPS healers is going to kill these three uh, uh, after, after they bring down the first one. So they will kill the first burrow as soon as possible and then after that they will try to kill the um, three of them, three of the mobs. Uh, as at the same time they're gonna have to protect Hojins because if you let this guy die, the run is over. So, and the second one, the Kaida, his job is to uh, engage with either of these three, either of the, these three, and we'll kite them around the table. So he's just gonna run, run around the table, like this. So for example, if the breeder coming from the fourth burrow, and he's just gonna engage with the breeder, and we're just gonna kite him around the table. That's his job. Now, as for the attacker, their job is to go around and kill the rest of the burrow. So they will try to bring out the second one as soon as possible. And then after that they're gonna go for the third one. And after they bring out the th third one, they will come back and help out with the team. Try to kill these three and uh, take out the pressure from Hojins. And after that they will come and kill the fourth fifth and lastly will be this one so that's the plan i've seen the plan i hope it gives you an idea of running this dungeon now and you can see that i'm in the attacking group so i had to go around and try to kill the burrows now this i find quite strange for the melee class if you stand and attack the burrows your attack will most likely to be missed most of the time i don't know if it was glitch or something so the best way to deal with it in this case is to go around the burrows and in the circle and try to hit it there will be two breeders the first one is coming out from the second burrow and the second one will be coming out from the fourth or the fifth burrow now if you kill the second burrow fast enough there won't be a breeder coming out of it so try to get it down as soon as possible now as for the scarves they will two hits kill you the signal for this attack is when they're starting to howl. That's when they use. That's when they're gonna use the attack on you. So when you see it, try to avoid it. Other than that, just proceed according to the plan, and I will see you in the next video.
Come help Hodge here. shape here. I'm down. Last burrow is at 75. 40. Twenty-five. 